giving all praise and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakaak, Wadash, double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, and a sincere shalom to the Akim that's out there pushing their sincerity and the truth and their sound doctrine. First and foremost, I want to say the water Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, for giving me and a fellow Akim the opportunity to do these lessons in these videos, the opportunity to go out there on the highways and on the hedges, all to edify and warn the nations of Israel, which are the so-called Negroes, the Latinos, and the Native Americans, the 12 tribes of Israel, the ones the law, statutes, commandments, as well as the promises were given to. Shalom. So this is a um, a really quick video on um, this, this article that popped up uh, earlier. Um, uh, it says Maryland Democratic Party officials out after um, racially insensitive uh, emails surfaces. All right. So you see here a Maryland the Democratic Party official and longtime party party donor uh, has resigned after an email she sent questioning the eligibility of black candidates in the state's gov uh, in the state's governor's uh, race. All right. It says this the state party chair announced Monday. All right. All right. So. You know, um, down here, um, you know, in the comments. We do not, down here, uh, if I can highlight it real quick, yeah, I'm right there. It says, we do not condone, let me just, yeah. it says, we do not condone or support uh, the comments in her, in her email. So, here's the thing, man, you know, you know, this is, this is, uh, you know, this is why, you know, us, you know, through the spirit of Paulo, how about Shimei Al Shah, we always analyze these things and we always, or quick to the trigger when it comes to these um these uh these situations both both are wrong man why because israel has no business mi mingling in with it with edomites man and this is why you know this is why and then jake get mad you know they sit up there and say this is racist this is this this is that and while we sit up there and tell you that this system is not made for you man they are always, don't matter what these Edomites say, man, while while there may be some some all right ones, it don't matter, man. They all going to pay as a nation, all right? I ain't going to be on that, there's a good Edomite and a bad Edomite. No, man, ain't no such thing as a good Edomite, man. They all devils, even even ones that, that are sincerely all right with you because you do have some of them. We had some of them in slavery that was sincerely all right. They didn't even help this out. At the same time, it doesn't matter because they all gonna pay as a nation. See, did, did we, did we, did all of us as Israel go off? Not all of us went off, but the Lord said, "I'm punishing all y'all niggas as a, as a nation, man." So it's the same thing with this, man. You Jakes sit up there. We tell you Jakes that this man in this system is not made for you. All right, this ain't your rest. Why you mean, you know, you shouldn't, you know, Jake, you don't have no business mingling in with their, with their politics or anything like that, man. So this, this ain't made for you, man. And they're always going to look at you as their enemy, man. No matter what the hell they say, no matter how much they smile in your face or whatever, they always going to look at you as a nigga, man. You know, they're always going to look at you as that, man. No matter what you try to do, no matter how many laws you try to, you know, enforce, how many hbcus and shit like that y'all try to enforce you know which you know y'all y'all still don't you know the hbcu they don't you know speak against esau edom anyway you know they 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 want to uh prove you they want to say that they're equal to esau edom so they could give them equal rights and shit like that they will never look at you as equals man and guess what we're not made to be equal man first off we got a higher spirit than them but they're in power right now. The Lord was never about equality, man. It was always a person in power. It was always a nation of people in power. All the time, man. All right? This is what you Jakes get, man. You know? We tell you that you the chosen seed of the Most High, man. We tell you that they your enemies. And what do you do? What do you do? You call us a hate group. You tell us stop spreading false lies. Stop spreading lies and shit like that. You know? You walk. You, you send your sodomites. Sodomite Christian minions up. You know, with the, with with the little microphone or whatever, walking by, telling us we 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 we're speaking lies or whatever, man. We're speaking lies, and shit like that. This is what you jakes get, man. This is exactly what you jakes get. All right, what you want us to do? Feel sorry for you, man. 
you know? This is what you jakes get. The Lord always had a chosen people. And whether you Edomites or you jakes want to accept, you know, whether you vote vocabites want to accept, you know, because you got a lot of jake follow vocab to speak just to speak against us, man. And most of them probably don't even believe in what the hell he teach. But just because, you know, a lot of jake don't like us, of course, they're going to go with, go, you know, with massive vocab, man. You know, let me go ahead and get a scripture, man. All right. Now, this is the book of um, 2nd Ezra, chapter 5, verse 23. And said, O Lord, that bearest rule of every wood of the earth and of all the trees thereof, thou hast chosen thee only one vine, right? Thee, one only vine. It says, thou hast chosen thee. So, like, thou hast chosen thee one only vine, all right? So, that's one. So, so for people... That, you know, for people that say the Lord don't got favorites, what is this, man? Verse 24. It says, and of all lands of the whole, uh, of like, and, of, and of all lands of the whole world, thou hast chosen thee one pit, and of all the flowers thereof, one lily, and of all the depths of the sea, thou hast uh, filled thee one river. Why does it always keep just saying one, man? You got all these different. So let's let's go down the list, right? So it said, of all of every wood of the earth and of every tree, it's like and of all the trees thereof, thou has only chosen one one vine, man, just one. Now let's go to the next verse twenty four. Uh, of all the lands of the whole world, thou has only chosen one one pit, and of of and of all the flowers thereof, one lily. Come on, man. Let's go on down to the next. And of all the depths of the sea, thou hast only filled one river. For real? It says, and of all builded cities, thou hast only hollowed a sign unto himself, man. Until until thyself. All right. So, and, oh, verse twenty four, verse twenty six. It says, and of all the fowls, right that that are created. There uh it's like it and of all the fowls that are created, thou hast named the one dove. All right, it says and, and of all the uh, the cattle that are made up, it's like that are made, thou hast provided thee one sheep, and among all the multitudes of people, thou hast gotten thee one people, and unto this people whom thou lovest, and gave us a law, gave us a law. All right, a law, all right? It says that is approved of all, all right? So who 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 is that? Let's go on to the, you know, let's go, you know, you can't get around these scriptures. You cannot get around these scriptures. The book of Deuteronomy chapter seven, verse six. And this goes towards you Edomites and Jake, man. Because Jake could be the main ones coming up towards men. Nah, man, you know, God died for all people. He ain't died just for one people. What the hell is wrong with y'all, man? Y'all going, you know, y'all just wicked, y'all hate, y'all just, y'all just full of hatred. Deuteronomy chapter 7 verse 6. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy power. The Lord thy power, Yahweh by Shimei Shai, have chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. It's always, it's already been, look man, when you read, you know, uh, the beginning of, of Second Ezra, the fifth chapter, the Lord already set this in place before any, even anything was created man you know read this part read the read, read uh second as the fifth chapter and then you can continue on down all the way down man you can continue all the way down and it's, it's prophecy man it's prophecy he already he already seen this man he already it's like he already set this up man he already knew how this stuff was going to go before the earth was created all right before everything was even created man he he already had this written, you know, this this script ready and plan and primed to go, man. All right. Um. So I ain't, you don't even have to break that down, man. Let's go on down to um Romans, the ninth chapter. Since you know a lot of people say, well, you know, that was the God of the Old Testament. Well, okay. Romans chapter nine verse one. I say the truth in Yahweh Shai. I lie not. 
my conscience also bearing me witness in the Holy Spirit. All right. Bearing him witness, man, which means he's he is a a, a street witness to to you know the spirit, man. He's a street witness to a lot of you know to, to this stuff, man. Bearing him witness that I have great heaviness and continual sorrow in my heart. All right, verse three it says, For I could wish that myself were accursed from Yahweh Shah for my brethren, for my kinsmen according to the flesh. So you got a lot of people, you know, you got a lot of Christians out there that say, Well, you know, just you could that this is what you know, that's when people, you know, that's why that's when Christians don't have anywhere to go, you know, which they they don't at this point, they don't, because now they now they they taking every every little word like vocab, uh uh like but as a recently he goes in Revelation the um the, the first chapter where they're talking about, you know, the, the pretty much the appearance the appearance of Lord Yahweh Shai. And he was saying that uh you know uh uh, um, it was like fine brass. It was like fine brass. It, it, does, it doesn't mean it doesn't mean it was fine brass, you know. But it was like fine. You look, man. Even if it even if it was like fine brass, or or you know, it was really really dark, and that's that's what he said. He said it was like fine. If I if I said, hey, uh, I got a speaker that's that's blue, like 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 blue it's not exactly well it's like light blue it's not exactly light blue but it's it's like light blue or some shit like that then that that would mean it's still like blue it's still blue or something like that man you know what i'm you know what i'm getting at you know uh 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 you know what's a what's a it's so many examples you could you could make on that man you know i could say a car was like was like a like a like a grand marquee but or like a ford you know let's say it's like it was like a ford but it is not exactly a ford but it has the same you know make and model of a ford car you know but at the same time it's not exactly a ford but it it, it it's you know like a ford you know what i'm saying so that statement right there just doesn't even make any sense, man. That would mean he would still be, <laughs> he would still be that complexion. As far as Yahweh Shah, he would still be that dark complexion. You know, I mean, he was exactly, exactly fine, dark, fine brass, as if it was burnt in a furnace. You know, but that means he was, he was still a very dark man. You know, a dark, a dark skin, a dark skinned man. Either way. So it's the same thing with this. You got a lot of Christians, you know, where it said, my brethren, my kinsmen, according to the flesh. You got a lot of Christians sit up there and say, well, you know, you could you, 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 you be a spiritual Israelite. You, you could be a spiritual Israelite. Look, man, the only way to be a spiritual Israelite, you have to be an Israelite first, a, a, a born Israelite first, according to the flesh. That's the only way you could be a spiritual Israelite. We are we are considered spiritual Israelites. These jakes out here not, are not spiritual Israelites, but they are Israelites. But they're not spiritual Israelites. Vo the, the jigs that follow vocab are Israelites, but they're not spiritual Israelites. All right. And it said, my kinsmen, when you talk about kin kinsmen, you talk about flesh, man. That's why I said according to the flesh. So every time you see kinsmen, my kin, you know, that is flesh. That has nothing to do with spiritual, man. All right. That's straight up flesh. And it said, my brethren, my kinsmen, according to the flesh, you can't get around this, man. Right. Who are Israelites? Who are what? Who are Israelites? To whom pertain of the adoption, all right, and a, and the glory, and the covenants, and the and the giving of the law, and the service of the Most High, and the promises, all right. Whose are the fathers, all right, and and of whom are is concerning the flesh, Yahweh Shai came, who is over all, all right, the Most High blessed forever. A month. You can't get over these scriptures now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to go on to the next verse. It, this script, man, this whole Bible, this whole Bible condemns you Edomites, man. All right, and it condemns all you Jakes that follow these Edomites too. Want to want to mingle in with the with these with these devils, man, in the political system, man. This is what you Jakes get, man. This is what you Jakes get, and this is why the Lord told us what: don't pray for these people. Romans chapter one, verse one, so like Romans chapter ten, verse one. Brethren, my heart's desire to, to uh, and prayer 
to the Most High, for Israel is, all right, that they might be saved. All right, let me read that again. It says, brethren, my heart's desire and prayer to the Most High for Israel is that they might be saved. Why didn't they say everybody, man? And never said everybody. And never, you go into the, the Greek and the Gentiles and this and that. I ain't gonna go there right now because that's going. That's that's you know, uh, a lot of a lot of brothers already go into that a lot, you know. But the video went on long enough already. But you know what I'm going to continue to do is I'm going to continue to read on verse two, for I bear them record that they have a zeal of the Most High, but not according to knowledge, for they be ignorant of the Most High's righteousness, and and going about to establish their own righteousness. All right, and it's like they have not submitted themselves. Unto the righteousness of the Most High. Why is it still talking? It says, For Yahweh Shai is the end of the law for righteousness, all right, to everyone that believeth. And that says to everyone that believeth. That don't mean the law was done away with. All right. Let me let's let's clear that up real quick. First, let me let me keep let me, you know, go back. So it says, For they be ignorant of, of the most high's righteousness and going about to establish their own righteousness, having not submitted themselves unto the unto the righteousness of the most high. Now again, up here it said, it said, brethren, my heart desire and prayer to to the Most High for Israel is that they might be saved. Now when you jump down here, and this one, but when you jump down here, it says they they have not submitted themselves unto the Most High. What is this saying? That mean that means what? That Israelites are the only ones that could submit themselves to the Most High because why? Well, when you read when you go back to Romans the third chapter, it said what? Even in Leviticus. Uh, Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, mainly Leviticus, you know, and Deuteronomy. Exodus, Leviticus, uh, numbers of Deuteronomy, man. It old, a lot, man. You see that an awful lot. All right. It says those who do not keep the Israelites, Israelites, you know, who do not keep my commandment and do all you got to do is type it in, man. All you got to do is read it. And this is why we, this is why we always um, promote, uh, uh, you know, self educating, man, you know. So you you look you you know watch the videos for edification yeah, but you gotta you gotta really you gotta you know do the research yourself, you know, and read man, you know and, and, and other than that that's between you and the Most High anyway. So it said, "Who are Israelites to whom pertaineth the adoption and the glory and the gut and the covenants?" And you can find this in uh, Jeremiah the thirty first chapter and the thirty first verse. And you could also find the same thing in, in Jeremiah. You could find the same thing in Hebrews, the eighth chapter and the eighth verse. Who are Israelites to whom pertain of the adoption and the glory and the covenants and the, and the giving of the law. And the, hold on, it said the giving of the law. That means what? Let's go, let's go on back, you know, to verse 10. I mean, uh, chapter 10. What did it just say here to be at the last part and have not submitted themselves unto the righteousness of the most high? There you go. So only Israelites can do it, man. Only Israelites can do that. Verse four, for Yahweh Shai is the end of the law for righteousness to everyone that believeth. Now, again, you know, these Christians, man, y'all not, y'all not slick, man. You know, y'all not slick at all. Y'all sit up there, y'all sit up there and read that. It's like, yeah, yeah, you know, the God, Jesus coming back, you know, was, was the was the end of the law. But what did it say Every, to everyone that believeth? The law, the law wasn't written for people that already believed. They already knew. All right. That was, it was, it was, it still pertains to them. Yeah. It's, you know, we still follow it. But did, like, for example, while we do these videos, we don't, we don't do this. We don't do these, the, at least, especially these type of videos. To to you know for each other, we already know. I mean, yeah, we'll watch them, you know, maybe get a little edification out of it, even still. But this is mainly to the people that don't know. You know, this is mainly to the people that don't know. We 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 all at least already should know better. All right, so that means the you know a lot of things don't even, don't even pertain to pe the people that already believe because it's not it's not given to them, man. For at least for the ones that, that believe. That's what I meant. That's what I mean. So that's what this is saying. You know. It didn't say. Yeah, it, it was look, you know, the Lord didn't Matthew um uh the the fifth chapter in the seventeenth verse said what? I came not to destroy the law but to fulfill. 
So now this sounds a little contradictory to that, right? This is why you got to be spiritual to understand these scriptures. All right. So no, this, this verse four is not talking about, you know, the law being done away with. I just did a short little video on that yesterday, man. You know, talk about that grace, that grace thing, man. How how Christians just maliciously use that, man. You know, just just it's an excuse to so to say, well, we're in a land full of unrighteousness and infirmities. They you know they don't say that, you know, but they you know in their mind they're like, well, we're surrounded by wickedness, which is you, you know, we're surrounded by wickedness, and you know I you can't really help it. So you know, we're under grace. So hey, don't I don't even, don't even gotta worry about it. This is why Christianity is falling, man. And this is a prime example. This right here is a prime example of Christianity, man. Teach, trying to teach everybody that they're equal. Look, man. No, no nationality is equal. It's like no gender is equal. None of this shit. N n nothing is. N look, if if everything was equal, everything you would have this. Why is there a variety of phones, man? Why is there a variety? Of video game consoles. Why is there a video? Uh, so, so like, why is there a variety of t uh, televisions and a variety of trees and a variety of food and stuff like that? There's no equality here, man. You know, they're trying to enforce it, and that's that's what's messing everybody up, man. They're trying to enforce that equality, and now it's messing everybody up. When naturally, nothing is supposed to be equal. Everything is supposed to have a variety. Everything is supposed to have a flavor. All right. Why do you think the Lord made male and female, man? All right. He didn't make us to be equal. You know, the Lord, the Lord has flavor, man. Always a variety of everything. Why do you think it's a variety of planets? You know, planets, a variety of everything, man. Everything, a variety of shoes and stuff like that. Come on, man. Give it all praise, honor, glory to you.